let us walk through some of the core features of Strange New Worlds. Additionally, we will see some of its advanced features. To start off, when a page is loaded, two types of reference counters will appear. At the top of the page is the count showing how many links are incoming to this page. Just hover over this reference counter to see all the incoming links. Inside the document, there are reference counters in line with the text. This is showing how many times this reference is used in your vault. Again, hovering over the links gives you details. Let us go back to the header reference count. Clicking on the three dots in the upper right hand corner of the pop-up will load the same information into the sidebar. Let us review what information you will find here. At the top will appear the page name in question, or the name of the reference. Under that, you have the file name that is also pointing to this same reference. Under the file name you have a preview of each unique reference contained in that file. By clicking anywhere in the sidebar, other references can be opened into Obsidian. If you have the page preview control enabled, that plugin will work with strange new worlds. Even the hover editor plugin works with strange new worlds. This allows you to open up previews to documents and reposition those previews. You can also use a combination of keystrokes to open a file in. A horizontal pane. A vertical pane. Finally, all these features you have seen so far are also available in the pop-up window.